Anna Marie Finley, who is the Senior Project Coordinator of Child Obesity 180, will introduce Clarissa Brown, a student at the Friedman School of Nutrition, Science, and Policy. Did I leave somebody out? No, that's okay. We actually are out on it. Um, my name is Alyssa Kumis. I'm the project manager for Healthy Kids Out of School. And because it was really a team of us that um, nominated Clarissa Murphy Brown, we thought that there would be two of us here to um, introduce her. So um, I can start. I met Claire in 2012 um, when I was interviewing um, graduate students to help us do some data collection. And it was about a, a dozen different students that ended up helping us for a short amount of time. And I met Claire, and it struck me how positive and motivated and such a vision that she had. And I remember asking her what brought her to the Friedman School, because she was a Friedman student at the time, just started. Um, and she told me that it was, um, it was when she was studying in undergrad and she read about Shape Up Somerville and the work that our director, Chris Economos, had done um, to really understand how we can prevent childhood obesity um, that sparked something in her and that she got so excited and knew exactly what she wanted to do and she got a, I think it was a Tufts banner um, for the Friedman School that she hung over her desk while she was studying to motivate her um, to get through undergrad to make it to the Tufts and she did straight from undergrad grad um, and is currently um, finishing up her MS MPH um, while concurrently working towards her didactic program in dietetics at Simmons in order to be an RD. So um, in a, one more year, I think she'll have, let's see, seven letters after her name, which we're very proud of. Um, so Claire did that work with us in 2012, and then all of a sudden she was just around our office all the time at Child Obesity 180, which is at the Friedman School. Um, and our work at Healthy Kids Out of School, um, a, call, a coworker of ours said that Claire came to her to ask her about working on an ALE, and Claire's interest and excitement, and then what um, we had available for her, our colleague says that Claire was talking, and all of a sudden, all she could see were hearts in her eyes, thinking about Claire and how amazing it was gonna to be to work with her. Um, and we actually didn't have a position for Claire um, on our team. We have a pretty large team, um, we're grant funded, but somehow at this moment in time, Claire's working for us about 15 hours a week. Um, and in the summer, it's gonna be 20 to 25 because she is the most uh, amazing person. She is so confident, she is so driven. Um, she is so passionate toward helping people, working in the community. A lot of the work that we've asked her to do is on weekends and on evenings, going to trainings and working with people to help them understand the best way to um, provide healthy environments for children. And she has done that in Maine, in Massachusetts, in New Hampshire. She's been all over the three states with us. Um, and if I can say one more thing about Claire, um, it's her ability to roll with the punches. They say in improv, it's, it's yes and. And for Claire, it's yes and, how about this? And yes and, what else can I do? Um, she was at an event with us where we were doing a cooking demonstration and Claire sliced her finger <laughs> with all these little Girl Scouts around and held her poise and was very composed and um, is just an amazing person to be around, um, has added such a light to our team um, and we just can't wait to see what she's gonna do. So. I'm going to pass it to Anna Marie. Um, like Alyssa said, I think there's so many wonderful things that um, we could say about Claire, but um, I'll speak on behalf of, of my colleagues and I that it's really her dedication to um, the people that she you know, works for and um, to improving the lives of others through healthy nutrition that makes her so deserving of this award. Um, I've really come to learn that it's, you know, with Claire, it's 100% investment in the work and in the people um, that her work impacts. Um, when Claire's out in the community um, sort of serving through, you know, training on health and nutrition, she brings such a genuine spirit of humility that I think is really rare. Um, Claire really recognizes that she has as much to learn from, from others as she does to share. So it's been really wonderful to learn that from her. She's also involved with so many <laughs> community programs, that, too many to list, but among them um, the Quincy WIC program, the Friday Night Supper program, um, so it's really been such a pleasure to work with Claire, um, and I know that and, you know, nutrition and health will continue to be such a leader. So congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.